Yo, what up, guys? Jay Santy here, and today I'm coming at you with a an old school COD 4 gameplay. Uh, I was bored the other night, up late, so I decided to go grab my COD 4 disc and throw it in and play a couple games. I miss this game a lot. It was a good fucking game, so good. I could play this game for hours, not get pissed off, not get bored. You know, just play this shit and have so much fun this wasn't one of those games where you know you get killed by noob tubes were on this game i wouldn't say they were used as much but you know this was one of those games where you wouldn't get killed by dumbass explosives you wouldn't get predator missile you wouldn't get ac 130 you just had uav uh precision airstrike and the attack helicopter so, killstreaks weren't overpowered in this game, and I feel like getting a good game took more skill than any updated Call of Duty. But, in today's video, we're just gonna have a conversation, you know, as if we were talking in person. I don't have anything written down, don't have anything set up to talk about, really. Just, you know, got a good COD 4 gameplay, and I wanted to share it with you guys, maybe talk about you know, uh, future of Call of Duty, not necessarily Black Ops 2, just the future of Call of Duty, and, you know, just COD 4 versus other Call of Duties, so, you know, COD 4 versus something like Modern Warfare 2 is, I think, even though COD 4 is years old, I think if they made an HD COD 4 fixed all the graphics and everything, this game would still be one of the it would probably be the best call of duty because everyone if you ask anyone everyone likes cod 4 no one's like against cod 4 in modern warfare 2 i feel there were the people that loved it and there were the people that hated it i actually loved it i've never really i've, I've never really hated a call of duty i'll talk shit about a call of duty but when it comes down to it I mean, I keep going back to it, so I can't sit there and say I hated it. This is a nice streak right here, too. Watch this shit. I'm fucking tearing them up. But, you know, everyone talks shit about a Call of Duty, but you go back to it, and you go back to it, and you go back to it. You never just quit, and you're done. I mean, so as much shit as you want to talk. Look at, look at me tearing them up with the MP7, or the MP5. Fucking said MP7. I play too much Modern Warfare 3. <laughs> but... You keep going back to it and back to it, so don't talk too much shit because in the end you don't mean it and don't be one of those people that say shit that they don't mean. No one likes that guy. But in Black Ops, once again, I feel like everyone either loved it or everyone even hate or everyone uh, just hated it. I feel like in these Call of Duties, there's no middle anymore because they go to such an extreme in black ops in modern warfare 2 in uh modern warfare 3 i feel like all the updated call of duties just have such an extreme when it comes to kill streaks and guns that nobody really nobody can be in the middle because everything is just to such an extreme point that it's just like so it just hits you so strong like if you don't like kill streaks you're gonna hate call of duty if you're that person who likes to camp and if you wanna i'm not saying the only person that can like it is the person who wants to camp but if you're that person that wants to camp and rack up kill streaks and look like you had a good game but really you only get 11 kills and your kill streaks get 20 kills then you'll love the updated call of duties the last great call of duty i would say was world at war world at war was one of my favorite call of duties that was the last call of duty where you know skill and gun skill really meant everything skill and gun skill and updated call of duties doesn't exist as much as they did back in cod 4 and world at war you could go back to cod 3 and everything but not a lot of people played cod 3 a lot of people played it obviously but COD 4 was such a big step up from COD 3 and like play wise so many more people played it and I just feel like 
I just feel like skill in the past Call of Duties was so much, it differed players so much compared to Call of Duties today. Because people say, I believe it's from overpowered weapons and kill streaks. People say, oh, well, the M16 was overpowered in COD 4. The M16 was a fucking burst rifle. You still have to have a shot if you want to kill somebody with it. You can't just sit there with an ACR and spray the shit out of somebody and kill them. You have to actually use the M16, you have to burst it, and you have to hit people with it. That's like saying the MK14 in Modern Warfare 3 is overpowered. If you think about it, that gun could be overpowered. It's a two-shot kill if you hit people. So if everyone had a good shot and people were using that shit and a decent trigger finger, you were gonna you'll get lit up. So I mean, it skilled overpower weapons just don't exist anymore. Yes, there's there's a like there's gun skill. You do have to hit people, but a burst weapon is so hard to be overpowered. Type 95 was a one-shot every single time when Modern Warfare 3 first came out. That's why that was an overpowered weapon. M16, if, even if you go back to play today, it's not a one-shot every single time. So, I don't know how you could sit here and say it's an overpowered weapon. I mean, guns in COD 4, there was every gun you could pick up and do good with. You can't do that anymore in a Call of Duty. You can't pick up the fucking... Well, I'll say a gun and people will say... Oh, you just suck, so I'm not gonna go here and name a fucking gun. Pick up an M60, and you're not gonna do good every single game compared to if you had an ACR or an MP7. So, yeah, sure, you might do good. You might use kill streaks, but if you just use Specialist M60, you're not gonna do as good as you would if you use Specialist MP7 or Specialist ACR. It's just like kill streaks can make someone have a good game and I don't like seeing a game where I have posted videos where I had a good game but the point of the video was the kill streaks so I was showing you a good kill streak setup I wasn't saying hey guys I had a great game here it was all me no that's bullshit it wasn't all me it was my kill streaks I got like 20 something kills I think I counted them in the video so I mean it's just I just feel like skill I hope it comes back in black ops uh, I know there's gonna be kill streaks, but you know there's still a way they can make gun skill happen. Don't have the FAMAS from Black Ops. Don't have. I'm talking about Black Ops 2. Don't have the FAMAS from Black Ops 1. Don't have all the overpowered weapons. AK-74U. If you're gonna have an overpowered weapon, I feel make it a burst weapon because burst weapons are very hard to be overpowered. It's just uh. You, you can't spray people down. You actually have to have a consistent shot and be able to hit people every burst. So, you know, that's that's today's video, guys. Uh, just a little discussion. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I hope you like this video. And let me know if you want me to get some more COD 4 gameplay or what, you, what videos you would like to see in the future. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace out.